So the wait is over. Opening weekend of a new MLS season, the 25th anniversary season. And Inter Miami, the latest club to join the party, play their historic inaugural fixture here against an LAFC side who've come a long way since they were in the same situation just two seasons ago. New faces for, for as you say, for both sides. This is what uh, Miami don't want. They don't want people getting in behind them. And Vela's just made that run, got the run in behind. Great cross, great header and a tremendous save from the goalkeeper. Yeah, Luis Robles doing what he does. Called into action very early. Rossi's header. Also a goal scorer in the Champions League. Just trying to guide it across the keeper, really. Difficult to generate the power. We'll reach Rodriguez. He's done well. We'll see ahead of him as into Miami appeal for offside. But he's not going to miss that. Mark Anthony K. He's given offside. It has been pulled back. As is the case these days, the assistants wait. An offside given. The AR will have a look at it. But he's clearly off, isn't he? Here they come with Pizarro. to uh, deal with that. The game is certainly open enough, certainly open enough for, for both teams. Oh. And back by Rossi a little easily. Robles has made the save and then he's able to gather it up as well. Importantly so to deny Diego Rossi. Now you can't be giving balls away, you know, this is a free chance really, you know, messing about with the ball there. It's getting his chance at the start of this season. The departure of Zimmerman. Here's Alves Powell. And towards Robinson. Trying to tee up the strike for Victor Ojoa. Morgan might have a hit. He's tempted into it, but yeah, they're right behind it. It's good play. Ojoa. <laughs> Mexican born, Texas Rays midfield player. Eight years with FC Dallas. Diego Rossi did well to get his shot away. Vela trying to pick up the pieces. Still the chance for Jordan Harvey. But he's back in the way by then. And a bit of a miss kick by Ginella. Blessing winning it in the air. This is a look again. The latest sight of goal for LAFC. There were a couple of uh, glimpses of it in there. Robles has done really well, haven't he? He's made some really, really good saves. And they've had good opportunities. What they don't want to do is get caught on the break. With the ball in here, it was a poor clearance, good save. Pizarro trying to get there. And it's hooked away by Tristan Blackman. Well, it's as close as he's come. They've played some good football. They've created some good opportunities. The keeper's made a good save there. Looking for the run of Brian Rodriguez. Elvis Powell, who's with him. This is the danger. Rodriguez did well. And the finish not extending Lewis Robles. Got themselves a corner. Plenty of options in the middle as well. It's cleared as far as Pizarro. The mayor was behind it. Unable to hold it. Back in again by Pizarro. This time it was met by Nico Figal. Well, they're the, they're the two best chances of the game. Um, you know, the first chance, I think it gets stuck and stuck under his feet a little bit. But the second one, the header, he has got to score here. Placing this man though, is there? Here goes Carlos Vela again, and it will sit for him. Carlos Vela, audacious, oh. outstanding. What a goal! What a goal that is. That is what he does. Up and running again for the new campaign. Last year's main man, not letting those standards slip. Sensational from Carlos Vela. Some way to celebrate his birthday and to get his side season. Up and running just before half time here.
It, it's an unbelievable finish. The technique, get in there. I'd be really disappointed as a manager. He's gone past, what, three, four players, but once he's past them, to dink the goalkeeper, to chip the goalkeeper from that distance is just absolutely fantastic. You know, that's um, that's good enough in any league that you're looking at. Thomas Fuller to take the corner. The LAFC goal scorer swings it in. It's out by Torres, met by Blessing. Another again. They've started really well, haven't they? They really, really have started well. And at the other end, come uh, into Miami with Lewis Morgan. It's a dangerous ball as well, aimed towards Robinson. The man had to try and claw it away. Pizarro's in there. A little bit of panic setting in in that LAFC defence for a moment. Well, Inter Miami have created some very, very good opportunities. Great, great stand-up ball there from Morgan. And it's hit the defender on the back. He doesn't know nothing about it. It's going straight to Robinson. By Morgan. Particularly threatening, but he will get a second go. And that is much more dangerous. Oh! Just a fraction away from an historic equalising goal. Rodolfo Pizarro must have thought that was his moment. We'll reach uh, Rodriguez, he's got Rossi in the middle. Still Rodriguez. And Torres able to make the block. Didn't score from it, but they do get the corner from it. Rodriguez will take it. Oh, and it's over the top from Segura. That's a fantastic ball in again and a great opportunity and the lad should be hitting the target. I should be breaking the back of the net actually. That's a bad, bad miss. They have seen one against another of the Mexican powerhouses, Cruz Azul, in the quarterfinals of that Champions League competition. Later this month. They're back here at home next week against the Union before those matches. They have uh, work to do here. Robinson trying to get his shot away. Again, the kid has made a great race, a great pass into him, but it's a great run. It's just that final touch of him at times. He looks a little bit laboured. Pellegrini. Pellegrini. Just take your time and make sure you get good quality in. And it comes a little more threatening. It was Torres who rose to meet it. He's quite been a regular goal scorer for Panama at international level. He only scored his first ever MLS goal. His, uh, fifth season. His move might just get a little worse here because Rossi was in. Robles got a foot to it. They're always threatening the spaces behind those three players. They're always looking to pull off and looking for little balls that are played in. I think the fullback on the far side keeps him on side. The one last chance may be its win. Well, that would have been the headline. He managed to score the equalising goal right at the end on his return here, but never caught it really convincingly. And that will do it. LAFC off to a winning start in defence of the Supporters' Shield. Last season's top scorer gets the first goal of this season, the only goal of the afternoon, Carlos Vela. The wait for Inter Miami's first ever MLS goal goes on. They've been beaten at the Bank of California Stadium. LAFC 1, Inter Miami 0.